Hi, everybody. Uh, my name is Nick Vilku. I run growth here at Algolia, and I'm really excited today to demo the Algolia MCP server that we've just released in our GitHub repo. This is pretty experimental. It's not feature complete yet, but we're so excited. We really wanted people to play with it as quickly as possible. We'll keep, reiter keep iterating on it, keep adding new functions and features. Uh, but for now, I want to show you what we have. So let's start with a hypothetical index we're trying to create. I've opened up a new account at Algolia, and I want to create an index of sci-fi books, possibly for like a sci-fi book site um, or things like that. So I can actually have Claude help me with this. Hey, Claude, can you add the five greatest sci-fi books of all time to my Algolia index? Can you include, let's say, maybe awards and subgenres in the books? Now, of course, um, like you can be really prescriptive here if you wanted to. You can actually say, hey, here's the exact scheme I want. Here's the attributes. But I, I'm going to be a little looser here um, just to see what Claude will do for us. And so first of all, it's, it's coming up with the books. And so Dune, I think it's the greatest book ever. You can see genres here, space opera, the, the words that it's one. Foundation, another good one. I know sci-fi preferences are controversial. I think these two are pretty good up top. There's a few others here at Neuromancer, Left Hand of Darkness, and then Hyperion, one of my favorite books of all time. So there you go. Once that's done, Claude's like, hey, is it okay if I put the stuff in the index? So I will say yes. And within a few seconds, I'll be like, great, it's done. I go back here. And you can see, here we go. We got subgenres, we got awards, we got descriptions. It's great. All good. So now what do I do? Now I can think what's next. And so Let's have Claude makes this index better. Hey, Claude, what are some other attributes that would be compelling to sci-fi readers to put in our index? So now Claude is ideating with us. We're kind of pairing with it. Like, hey, what's up, dude? It's like a vibe. And um, it's like technology focus, this setting, the time period, the series information, a bunch of things here. Reading level, that's an interesting one. So why don't we uh, put that one in there? Hey, Claude. Can you add the reading level for each of these books to my Algolia index? And now it's going to, again, use its knowledge of the world and LLMs to, one, get the things in the system. And then it's going to start putting stuff in. So it's like, all right, first book is Dune. Dune's reading level is, of, um, is we'll see what it thinks. And it's going to go through all our books. And what's neat about this is you'll see it's doing it object by object because it's kind of being a little freeform, it's trying to do things that thinks it's best. But we could have actually said, hey, can you make this a bulk operation? And it would have done one larger out, like update. Um, we didn't, so it's, it's, it's taking its shot. But this gets the job done, especially for a small data set. So it did it. We refresh this page. We should now hypothetically see, if we look down, a reading level, advanced. A reading level, advanced. Advanced, these might all be advanced, intermediate to advanced. Um, so it worked. Now, one more cool thing to show that we can do with this new MCP. If I search for the word space opera, you'll see a bunch of books come out here. Hyperion is a space opera, Asimov is a space opera, and so is Dune. But let's just say we have discovered that Nebula Award winners tend to perform better in search results. We can actually have the MCP help us rank that higher. Hey, I'll go, hey, Claude, can you uh, change my search, my index, my index configuration to rank Nebula Award winners higher? So, First thing it's doing is it's checking how our index is configured. Cool, it's learned. Now it's also realized something. Since it put awards in with the year, it's kind of hard to search for them because you're searching for 96 versus 94 and whatnot. So it's actually adding a new attribute called Nebula Winner. And that attribute, now of course, we could do this differently. We could have told it, hey, can you make a list of awards? And then year is one. But because we haven't been that prescriptive, we're kind of letting it do what it thinks is best. So it added all those in. It's inserting them all. And so you can see here, 
real quickly before I give it more permissions, Nebula winners are on now. It's on or off. Now it's asking me for permissions to update the configuration of the index. So I'll allow it to do that. And it's been updated. So now if I go here to refresh and I search for Space Opera, it's already up there because I refreshed, but you can see the number one result is now Dune, not the last result. So this is just a demo of exactly like the power of this MCP. And I think there's so many cool things we can do with it. Uh, so I'm really curious to get it all your hands so you can all play with it as well. Uh, let us know what you think. Thanks.